you rather have a big rotor on the back or a small rotor? I mean, I'm not I saying... The big ones. Yeah. I'm just saying, why would anybody want a small back rotor on their bike? Only when you build up a bike for the weight. Uh, Geordie's bike, for example. His front rotor looks like it's brand new. His back rotor looks like it's been to hell. It's blue, it's black on one side, it's, it's like almost destroyed. Because he's got a, a 180 rotor really on the back. Shit rider. No, but I, I think he it's only like... only had a 180 because he only had a 180 when he built up the bike. Yeah, because that's Perfect. what, that's what uh, people spec with him really, don't they? They say, oh, you want a smaller rotor on the Maybe back. it's also because it's cheaper. I don't know in OEM business how much cent you save when you have a 180 instead of 203. But then would you agree that you, you, that you personally use the back brake more than the front brake when you're riding bike? Myself included, I like to drag the back brake and I use it to get me around corners. I do a little skid and like, so I am actually dragging, which is probably why, it's probably slow. Also always on the front. You don't close the front, but you're sliding with the front always as well. Only in a straight line. As soon as you start turning, you don't want to touch the front brake because you're off-road and it gets all slidey. You try not to, or I try not to anyway. I try, but mostly don't. So you use the back brake pretty much. Well, it's my emergency brake. I can close them without, uh, the back can slide. And when the front starts sliding, it gets a little bit sketchy. So you use the the back brake more than the front brake? I'm not sure about this. But I also have a lot of weight what you need to break down. I don't I don't think you're that heavy. That's not a huge amount of weight to be slowing down, but you, you do want a bigger back brake. Because you use the back brake more than the front. I don't agree. You, you don't use the back brake more than the front. Why? Do they build mountain bikes up with a small back brake and a big front brake? Why I'm asking is because I think they do it to be like a motorcycle, because a motorcycle has a small back brake and a big big front. Unless it's a, a off-road bike, and then they have pretty much similar. But so they're doing it because um, uh, you can have you've got more engine braking, so you're using the engine braking a lot more. You back off the gas and the bike slows down. Yeah. Whereas you can't do that. And like also, backing backing off the gas is like you you're using the back brake on a bicycle exactly. the same as backing off the gas. So you're using the back brake a lot more, which means it's getting hotter, so you need the bigger surface area for it to cool down quicker. Otherwise you'll just melt melt the smaller rotor on the back. Yeah. So I'm just wondering why anybody would want to have a smaller rotor on the back makes no sense to it, me. It doesn't make any sense it's to me either. It's maybe also coming, they copy it from the motorcycle industry. Yeah, yeah. 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 that's, that's it. They've just different. looked at looked at motorcycles and cars, maybe, you know, some I cars... Have... Copy. I think yeah. the bicycle industry is just a mix of so many different... They copied a little bit from here, they copied a little bit from here. So what would you do? Oh, I like a big back brake. I don't know why people go for a smaller back brake except to save weight but then I think you're compromising braking performance what rotors have you got on your trail bike or down a bike oh I've got on all my bikes I've got the uh, biggest one biggest Shimano ones I can get because I like my brakes if you could have a choice on Greg's bike what size rotors would you have the 203s they seem to work well um, I think any bigger than that and they there's a chance of you hitting the ground with them, or more of a chance of you hitting the ground with them, or getting it's getting stuff on them. Like if you go through a puddle, you can splash, and you might contaminate the pads easier if there's bigger, more surface area. And I think he seems quite happy with the 203 rotors. And I don't know if he needs any bigger. Um, also, if you yeah, if your brakes are too good, you're slow, maybe. So yeah.